So school starts in a couple of days and I thought, why not wrap up the summer with a video telling you guys 10 reasons to apply to Olin. I know that for a lot of people out there, you may be applying to college this year. And I figured why not show you the reasons why I thought Olin was the best place for me and why you should consider it as well. So without further ado, let's get started. So the first reason why you probably should be thinking about applying to Olin is that we basically have no tests. Now, that might sound a little strange because maybe your school has been finals, exams, quizzes, all this stuff. And that's not to say that Olin doesn't have those things, but we basically don't have any exams. And what I mean by that is that Olin is a project-based school where we learn by doing and implementing our learning with projects. And so our evaluations come from these projects that we are able to build and they vary from difficulty. And that's the best part about it, is that you kind of tailor your goals and your projects to your needs and what you want to accomplish. So yeah, we basically have no tests. Now that's not to say that you're gonna be test free or quiz free all four years, but you really do have a chance at applying your knowledge through a different way other than taking a test. And that way is through project-based learning. Now, the second reason why you should consider applying to Olin is that we have really, really, really nice dorms. Now, this might not be a deciding factor, but definitely figure out what you're comfortable with in terms of an undergraduate experience, especially if you're rooming and boarding. Olin rooms have internal AC and heating, so when it gets hot, you can blast the AC, and if it's cold, you can turn up the heat. Typically, first years are put into doubles, and doubles have their own sink and bathroom, which are really convenient because you don't have to share it with anyone else other than your roommate. And they look amazing, they are very spacious, they're connected, yes, separate in a way, and the space and your living and your living area is really big, to be honest. Doubles come with a microwave and a fridge, so you can heat stuff up if they get cold, if you bring something from the dining hall, uh, you can heat it up and you can also keep stuff cool in the freezer or fridge. And yeah, this was very important to me because I didn't want to have to bring a fridge or a microwave. And luckily, Olin rooms already have that. Suites are a little bit different and I'll be living in a suite this year. So I will be documenting my experience living in a suite amidst the 2020 uh, pandemic. But just want to let you know that the doubles at Olin are fantastic and you will feel super comfortable and definitely have a really good living experience here. The third reason to apply to Olin comes with the fact that everyone on campus is so nice. At Olin, everyone, and I tell you, everyone is so, so, so nice to you. The professors are one of the nicest people out there on campus. They eat lunch with you. They're amongst us as students. Many, if not all professors are more than willing to engage in a meaningful conversation, whether that be with engineering, or with something else that you're interested in. An example of this is one of our professors on campus, Alan B. Downey. He writes textbooks and he also is a professor on campus and he typically goes out to run with students and that's actually really cool. Although I'm not a runner personally, I have seen many of my friends go on runs with him and the whole group. So it's really nice to be able to do that with a professor and then have that outside life as well as the academic internal rigorous lifestyle that you might be looking for at all. Reason number four is that wherever you go, the food is A1. Now, there are a multitude of options for people with different eating preferences, gluten-free, vegan, vegetarian, and the dining hall team is really good at working with students that have specific dietary restrictions or needs. Now, there are so many great food options at Olin that would often be overwhelmed, whether it would be to get a Chipotle styled like salad, or a burrito, sushi, meat, cultural food. I just had a lot of options. <laughs> and I'm telling you right now that food is not only diverse, but it is so good, so good. Now, if one of those days you prefer not to eat at Olin and you wanna try something different, you're more than welcome to go to Babson College's dining hall, Trim, and for me, I used to eat a lot there because their hours are slightly longer. They have a great multitude of options as well. Their food is great. The desserts are delicious. And Olin students have access to that, which is really great. We only have a certain amount of swipes, but as long as we have access, I think that that's such a great option to have. Reason number five comes with Olin size. And Olin isn't as tiny as you may think it is. Olin is a part of a collaboration between Babson and Wellesley, and that collaboration is called BOW. And the good part about it is that there's a shuttle that actually takes you to through all three campuses and it's free. You can technically go to Babson's campus and if you wanted to, you could also catch a ride 
on the shuttle for free to Wellesley, which is a really great liberal arts school. Babson is a really great business school. And of course, Olin is a very great engineering school. So you have that facility. So not only do you have the option to spread out and meet different people, Olin gives you access to be able to attend conferences around the nation and they have certain grants and a certain amount of funds that will be able to allow you to participate in that as well. Olin may be small by the numbers. Yes, we have 350 students, but we are very, very powerful. Coming in number six are the resources at Olin. Now, we have a bunch of resources, even though we're really small. The Olin Library, for example, has 3D printers that students are able to use once they're trained on them, and you can use them for any type of use. The library also has books because it is a library, but it also has tools and a sewing kit that students are able to use to create personal projects or to just have fun. We also have meeting rooms and quiet spaces for those that are trying to study or those that want to host a group meeting and want a place to be able to work efficiently. The Wiseman Foundry is a common makerspace for all three campuses to come together and make something, whether that be a table, whether it be a dance project, or if you just want to kick back and watch a movie. That space is amazing for all students to come together and be chill. Now, as I mentioned before, Owen students are allowed to go to Trim, but not only Trim, they also have access to Babson's Rec Center, which is called BRAC. They also have access to Babson's library, which is where I did most of my studying because I had a lot of friends from Babson. But going back to Olin, we also have shops where we're able to really take advantage of the tools that Olin provides us. And last but not least, I wanna mention that we also have access to mental health services with whatever kind of issue or problem we may be facing. We have access to all those things, which I think is really amazing. Number seven comes with the idea of passionate pursuits. Now, what are passionate pursuits, you may ask? Well, it's what the name suggests. You're pursuing a passion. Now, this opportunity is worth one non-degree credit. So it means that it will count as a credit, but it won't really count towards your degree. And the great thing about this is that Owen actually gives you funding for your passion. So depending on what you need, what type of supplies you need, maybe it's yarn, maybe it's electrical components, whether it's you want to learn how to dance. Owen is willing to give up to $150 to support and promote your passion. My roommate, for example, bought a ukulele, which I ended up using most of the time, but he wanted to learn how to play the uke. And Owen was able to pay for it, which is really great because imagine being open to exploring something new and having someone else support you in a financial way. I think that's one of the most amazing things that Owen has done for me and continues to do for me. And I'm just so thankful. And I wanted to share that with you guys. It's one of the reasons because you really, really, really would be able to learn so much and grow your mind and your skill set. And I just think it's an amazing opportunity that students should take advantage of. Number eight comes with the student community. Now, really quickly, I could talk about a lot of people that I've met at Olin and they all have something in common, which is that they're really nice, genuine, amazingly talented people. Everyone has their own kind of thing. Everyone really has their strengths, but we all come together as a collective and we all love and have a passion of some kind for engineering and not only engineering, but more generally, problem solving. We want to make the world and we want to leave it better than what we found it. And that community, that sense of community is something that you really should think about when applying to Olin. Number nine comes with clubs and teams. Now we don't really have a lot of sports teams because we're so small, but we have amazing engineering teams as in we have Baja and we have Formula. And I'm going to put the descriptions right here because I don't know them off the top of my head, but a lot of people are very interested in both of them. Sometimes it's hard to choose between which one you want to do. And not everyone is forced to do this, but it's a very popular group on campus. Now, if you're not really into those engineering teams or you want to add to those engineering teams as well, you have certain clubs that expand and honestly widen your scope of what's possible and what's cool. An example of this is OFAC, which stands for Olin Fire Arts Club, and they spin literal fire. They usually have presentations during Candidates Week, which is really nice. Another group that I was a part of was Midnight Riders, and this was a group that I joined initially in college because I wanted to learn how to unicycle for some reason. So I learned how to unicycle, and it was a really nice experience. It was a really fun group, and I got to see a lot of people fall. I fell. Oh my God, it was terrible. But it was so much fun. <laughs> yeah, a lot of opportunity to be able to do that at Olin. 
a little bonus there, um, you can also join intramural sports. So I'm a part of a volleyball club at Babson and I go there all the time and I play volleyball with the guys. They're so great. And yeah, that's just another example of how Olin is not that small. Now, the last and final reason why you should think about applying to Olin is that growth happens here. I'm a personal believer of you should probably jump in the deep end of the pool and fully send it as people like to say here, but it's really important to know that not everyone knows what they wanna do at first. And it's also important to know that not everyone has everything planned right now. I was honestly very nervous and very confused my first semester because I didn't know what to expect of myself and I didn't know what to do personally. I'm not gonna lie, I had kind of very little experience with engineering when I was coming in and now I can't stop thinking about what could I do with the tools, with the learning, with all my classmates around me. I'm just so excited to be back on campus. And I know that you're probably excited to start college or you're probably starting to think about college, but I assure you, Olin is a place where growth happens. And if you wanna grow, definitely think about coming here. But that is it for today's video. Um, I hope you enjoyed the reasons that I mentioned. Um, it's really important that you go ahead and if you like those reasons or any of them sounded appealing to you, that you go and do your research on Olin because there is so much more that I left out. I strongly recommend you check out Olin's website, www.olin.edu, and look at the amazing work that we're doing on campus, outside of campus, and around the world. I'm very excited to be back on campus. This is my last video for the summer. And I hope you guys enjoyed it. Until I see you on campus or around somewhere in the world, I hope you have a great day. And again, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe to Olin's channel. Have a safe one out there, guys. See you soon.